Arca West, probably. I can't believe this is the last race already, though. I'm looking forward to next season's schedule, though. Hopefully, uh, nothing impacts that, like another pandemic or something stupid. At least it's less than half now. away from Houston <clears throat> in College Station, Texas, and we're getting ready to bring you a good one. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler in the booth, I mean, along with Kirk Hurst. Johnson Curry. hasn't Andrews won a single race since that, that, that with that package. We're under the lights tonight for college football action brought to you by Spark, because better athletes make better football players. Tonight's game between the Texas Longhorns and the Aggies of Texas a and like, with this incredible season drawing closer to an end. For Texas, a lot's going to depend on how well they can contain this quarterback. I'm sure he's aware that these aren't the best corners on earth, and he's ready to do some damage. Kickoff's just ahead, but first let's head to midfield for the coin talk. Brought to you by Spark, because better yeah. athletes make better football players. <clears throat> We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. <coughs> he makes it out to maybe the 20 yard line. For Texas, give us a sense of how their offense works. You want to watch how quickly I want, other plays develop. I would be it's curious though too if control with this you know they hear and they use well, like Jeff Gordon and stuff if they were racing with this. Doesn't give the defenders a whole lot of time to A lot of the older guys were racing. I 
<clears throat> it's second and four. Ball on the 25. Because Tony Stone retired in 2016, and Gordon retired in 2015. And uh, that's like. Right. Looks over the middle, and it's picked off. Inside the middle. 30. The 10. Touchdown. Big play. 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 Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. He was a step too late and he knows it. Learn not to make those what? kinds of mistakes. <clears throat> I'm playing NCAA football and I just had a pick six and I got called back because of roughing the passer. It's first and ten. On the 40. I'm on the PS3. Hands off left and he's brought down quickly. <laughs> and the ball carrier wasn't getting away from that tackle. From their own 41 yard line. It's second down. <laughs> Hand off and he's met immediately. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. I'm telling you, every <laughs> yard you gain is earned. And those were about as tough as they come. Third down now, and they need to get it out to the 50. It's getting louder down on the field. They give to the tailback. I don't really know what this one's for. Let's find out. <laughs> They'll line up for another third down play because of the penalty. Well, here you're in a third down situation, and then someone makes a mental mistake. It makes your blood boil if you're a coach. Third down now, they need to get it out to midfield. <clears throat> yeah, I can. Back to pass. He chucks it downfield. Doesn't get there. Intended that time for the wide receiver. Sometimes the ball just kind of sails on you. I'm sure he wouldn't mind having that one back. So it's fourth down. The punt team is on the field looking to kick this one away. Burke will be the return man. It's away and it's a booming punt. Burke takes it to 21. Oh, man, did he take a hit. So he got a little on that return. Well, Brad, early it looked like there was an opening there, but the seam closed quickly. You wouldn't believe what happened the other day, my job. What? They'll go to work at the 29-yard line. This lady. The quarterback <laughs> in the gun. Empty backfield. Five wide yeah, receivers like in the formation. Throws incomplete. Broken up. He showed you some of his natural athletic ability following the play and making a really quick stab to knock away the pass. Because they didn't have a face pass pulled all the way up. Like they nose, they nose was like exposed. But it wasn't a big deal though. And then up the middle for a nice game. The delayed handoff picks up about six yards there. Oh god. From their own 35 yard line. Third down. And they had to like carry it up and shoot that the hole. And then when they were trying to throw in the cop car, drops back to pass. There's a very impressive open field tackle. Oh my god. <clears throat> First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 43. <laughs> Somebody didn't get so much sleep last night. Here's a give up the middle, tackle right away. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. It's second down, seven to go. <laughs> Ball on the 46-yard line. Pickens running the option. 
I'm not even sure the ball carrier saw the corner coming. For him. That happened so fast, he never had a chance to make a move. They're down, and they need to get it inside the 47. I've been, I've been hitting that career mode up, man. I'm in my third season. I got Pickings. Back to throw. Passes to the left, and it's going the other way. I'm really impressed with this guy's closing speed on the ball. He's got the kind of jets you need to be a standout corner. I'm at the point now to where I'm starting to compete up front. I'm towards the end of my go. Ball on their own 36. And I'm going, I'm going. So my rookie year, I had no wins. Campbell, options right side. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. And that was the sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. And they'll bring him down behind the line. Those linebackers do a great job of stopping the run. But they need to be careful to play action pass. You can easily get fooled and give up some big yards through the air. <clears throat> it's third down and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Yeah, I gotta play that again. I haven't played that in a while. That's, that's one I want to play. They'll run it. He gets out to about the 38 yard line. This is a good call by the defensive coordinator. His best run, and when the offense came with it, his guys were in position to make the stop. Oh, yeah. Mitchell is the punter. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Fielded at the 19. Tackle at the 24 yard line. You're always looking for the home run return, the big highlight. Didn't happen there, but he still got him a couple yards. <clears throat> the offense will start at the 24. I gotta got play that, man. Yeah, that's, that's one I. Excellent open field tackle. Well, the defensive backs completely jumped the run. <laughs> well, the run was never there. It was just that misstep that allowed the completion. I just received all the last ones too. But I hadn't started it yet. First and ten. Ball on the 42 yard line. Five wide. Rose, and he's right there to knock it away. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing I've got problem now is I got the PC and the PS3 and I got the well the capture card now, so I got the switch hooked up. So now I'm gonna be all over the place and I'm hardly have time for some games now. Because I got so many systems I'm trying to play. I was I was playing um, Mario Kart online earlier this week. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Gets the ball here and brought down in the backfield. That was nose to nose football right there, and the defense this time wins the battle. <laughs> Smith is waiting for the snap. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. Not real. I mean, How about that decision. That everybody's not a good play call. pretty good. Fourth I mean, I just started. That game's been out for a while. I just started playing online, so. The offense will start at the 20 yard line. We've got a first and 10. I didn't say that, though. The right side doesn't get much. Good tackle. A two-yard run by the halfback. It's second and eight. Ball on their own 22. <clears throat> They'll give it off here. A lot of it is just luck, though, because of how many items you get hit with at the certain time. Because I was running good one one of them. I was running second, and then I must have got hit like four times with something. 
Gets the ball here and brought down in the backfield. That was just a case of one lineman dominating another and making the play. And that's the end of the first quarter, and we've got a tie ball game. Yeah. Um, that's the annoying part, man, is we're in the front. And then all of a sudden. <clears throat> it's second down and 11 to go. Ball on their own 32. Setting up blockers, your running backs got it on the screen. I know. And he is drilled at the 38-yard line. Five, maybe six on that screen pass. And I thought this play was going to go for more yards, but the defense did a good job of shutting it down before the halfback could get any further downfield. <laughs> Steps back to pass. Short throw over the middle and it's picked off. And he's tackled at the 42-yard line. Mm. This quarterback better start making better decisions in the passing game. Otherwise, this corner will come up with even more picks in the future. I know. Gives it to the back. Nice run up the middle. The halfback picks up maybe five yards on the draw play. We got a second and five. Ball on the 37. Yeah, yard. I, I, man, I really wish everybody would get back on there again because I want to have a good. That was funny, man. I, and down he goes at the 29 yard line. That was a good reaction to the blitzing linebacker. That's what you like to see out of a young quarterback. Definitely need to definitely need to let me know on that one. I'd definitely get on with everybody because that was funny. That was funny. From the 29 yard line. First down. Like my cousin. I think the funniest thing was my cousin raising. He rolls out to the right. The flag came from the umpire, and that means this is probably holding. My little sister, my little sister's in there. My cousin. You told the whole board get that one. If you want to ruin the drive, just grab a hold of a defender's jersey. So it's first down oh, wow. and an eternity. Looks over the middle and it's picked off. <clears throat> he still has time to get this thing straightened out, but adjustments will have to be made or else his passing game will become a liability. Three-yard line. It's first down. Yeah. They'll take it inside, but the defense is ready. The back gets three on the carry. It's second and eight. Ball on the 36-yard line. Would you work early today? Going deep, lays it out there. And for Burke, he comes up big. That's his second interception of the day. This is what this corner is known for. He has great speed and is very good in coverage. He's also shown off his hands a little bit today. <clears throat> Pickens, looking to throw on first down. Unfortunately, I've taken a few of those in my day, and they are not pleasant. I'll just put the fish and touch on his wall and upload it. Because I did one thing, and that was, um, I had to re-record uh, a certain part because it Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. And, uh, Put the 
hustle him down in the backfield. Three-yard loss there. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. From their own 14-yard line. Third down. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Laying it out there. He's got his man beat. And he got it. Oh, so close to breaking it. He sort of rainbowed that one into the air, which can be risky. You're giving the defender or multiple defenders time to get there. But that time, it worked out nicely. I'm trying to do A little laundry on the field, and we'll find out whose it is. <laughs> Way too much jersey there. Pretty easy call for the official. <clears throat> First and long, ball on the 38. Straight run, nothing going on there. First and ten, and they continue to work you the know, ball downfield. They need to avoid, and I was telling, I was telling people like who's making the game. And it, it was like going on. Looks like someone was called for holding. About you know who's making the game, so that's like the game background. Oh, yeah. These are the calls that drive a coach yeah. crazy. Senseless penalties can sometimes be the difference between winning and losing the game. So first down once again, but a long ways to go after that penalty. Yeah, I gotta check it out. Runs left and can't get back to the line of scrimmage. This is picture-perfect defense by this corner. Great job of providing run support. It's second down and a long way to go. Ball on the 32. Oh, he is? Going to go across the middle, caught. So the quarterback completes the slant pattern for about a nine-yard gain. Third down again. Now he tries to buy some time. I don't really know what this one's for. Let's find out. <laughs> It'll be third down again after that penalty. Yeah, they only have more yards to pick up for the first down. Third and long here, and they hope to convert another one and keep this drive going. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five receiver look. Pickens drops back, throws out to the running back, no good. The tailback, the intended target. Well, here the quarterback put just a little bit too much on the ball and overthrew him. They'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt. The holder is set at the 40. This would be a 50 yarder if it goes. And he nails the long field goal. Great snap and a perfect hold. And he just had an what awesome happened? follow through. Everything went right there on that long field goal. So the score now. Texas yeah, I, I, I just heard Texas that on college Smith. game day. They brought it up. Smith has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. He puts it deep downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They'll start at the 20. First down, 10 to go. 
Yeah, and I mean, if they did run it. Oh, God. It's not. Oh, don't let them score. Are you kidding me? God. Excellent play anyway. by the quarterback, making the proper reads and finding his playmaker for the score. How'd they just get that long play right away? Oh, my God. Uh, anyway, I just took a 3 nothing lead, and they go ahead and score on the first play. And he hits the PAT. The, the, if, if, uh, if every state did the same exact thing from the beginning, Texas, yet set the instead of every away. state doing their own thing, that's what we're still in this. If every, every state did the same exact thing, I think everything would be a lot better. There's a flag on the field, and I think I have a good feeling of what this might be. Way too much jersey there. Pretty easy call for the officials. They'll start this drive at the 15-yard line. First and 10. He heaves it deep. Big catch there as they knock him out of bounds. How did I just catch that? And the big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. Oh my guy, here we go with the mean. Five wide. Here we go with Rose the and it's knocked away. Great range as he's able to break up the pass. I know that the safety makes a good play here, but as a receiver, you got to get in there and play some defense. He's lucky that one wasn't intercepted. <laughs> Oh my God. Here we go. He got a lot of jersey on that play. Not too much argument about this call. Well, holding is that obvious. The official most definitely is going to bust him. You hold it. Second down and a ways to go because of the penalty. I said, you both? No. I didn't. Pickens drops back. Missed him. You definitely want to give your receiver some room to run under the ball, but not that much. Even though Joe, I can tell Joe Biden a little bit more than Bob. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. He's not, he's not that much better. Pickens drops back at the 30 to the 20 to the 10. Yes, touchdown. Take that. Great effort by the wide receiver. And not to take anything away from the quarterback, but the wide receiver made this play. And doesn't it always seem like he just finds a way to get open? On a third and 20. Will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. A four-play, 84-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, how about the guys up front? The offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw. Smith has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. <clears throat> and he got all of this one. Great kick. He'll return it from the one. This flag came from the umpire, and that means this is probably holding. Well, that penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they can just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. Yeah, I really thought they would make that more. At the 14-yard line, it's first and 10. Especially with the games taking up so much space. Here's the give. Gains his way to the 23-yard line. And the halfback picks up nine yards on the delay. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. And another thing. Another thing. They really... I really hope they are smart enough to put... To have more than two USB slots. Oh, wow. Man, 
He drops back. Do they only have two? Shed's one tackler. On the run, gets it to his man. At the 40, at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, huge play. The wide receiver flew down the field on that touchdown connection. Well, he has the speed to stretch the defense, and his hands are getting better every single game. Where was the coverage there? There wasn't anybody near him at all. A quick two-play, 86-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot, and they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. Taken down at the 30. <clears throat> Folks, let's pause now as we've reached the end of the first half. Our score it, at halftime. It's Texas stupid. 14, you know, people got Texas steering wheels, the VR, hard drives. I mean, that's stupid. Texas. It's I don't know. Ball off and we're just about set to get the second half started. Plus, if you plus if people plug their controller in, that's another slot. Down the sideline. It was the umpire that threw the flag, and generally, that's a holding penalty. Well, holding is that obvious. The official most definitely is going to bust it. From their own 14-yard line, it's first down. He's scrambling. Tackle at the 16. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I would have literally looked at him like, are you guys stupid? How are you not designing? How do you not put four, at least four USB slots in this thing? You know how many USB slots my computer has? From their own 31 yard line. First down. I have eight. and it's almost picked off. They're really fortunate that wasn't intercepted. Not a very smart decision by the quarterback. He had no shot at completing it. Yeah. From their own 31-yard line. Second down. He flings it left. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. That could have been a big play for the defense. Yeah, even though he had a good shot at picking it off, it's still a heck of a play to force the incomplete pass. They come out in a five-wide set. Pickings set to go to the air. That was not X. Oh my God, that wasn't even close. Brad, the quarterback had his man, and lo and behold, here comes the defender, and the play is oh over. God. Snyder is back deep to return the punt. Booming kick. Gets to about the 27-yard line. You know what? It might not have been a lot, but they moved the ball forward. Football's not a game won 100 yards at a time. You take what you can get. And he's level at the 37. Besides going deep on the fade, the slant route is probably the most commonly run route against man coverage. If the receiver gets a good inside release, it'll be a new set of downs every time. hit before it could go anywhere. Looks like the defense was in man coverage there, fellas, and that's why they stopped that screen. Yeah, and when the secondary isn't dropping back into zone, it makes it difficult to have success with that kind of screen play. <clears throat> Texas holds a four-point lead. Throws, and it's incomplete. <laughs>
Third and ten coming up. Ball on their own 37. Throwing on the run, and he pulls it in. And he's taken down at the 36-yard line. Well, what can you say? Sometimes you need a little bit of luck. And it's on the offensive side on that play. They got away with throwing into some heavy coverage. From the 36-yard line, it's first down. Oh, yeah. Hart gets a call. The 10. And they finally push him out at the 4-yard line. They've obviously They're found all a formula old. for moving the ball against this defense. Let's see if any adjustments are made before their backs are really against the wall. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. You got a lot of jersey on that play. Not too much argument about this call. Holding penalties can really kill momentum. Yeah. Sometimes if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. Texas looking to go up by two scores. He fights forward to about the 10. Walker gains about two yards on the run. Second down, threatening inside the 10. <laughs> and he makes it out to about the eight yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. That was a short game, but a nice tackle there by the senior corner who came in from the outside and made a nice play. Trying to get that home field advantage, and the defense is doing their best to fire up this crowd. And he's shoved out of bounds. I know. At the four. Bailey gains about four yards there. It's fourth down. They'll line this up, and it'll be about a 21-yarder. <laughs> Kicks away, and it is good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. They'll go to work at the 29. Throw to the tight end and in and out of his hands. Second down, 10 to go. Ball of the 29. Oh, God. <clears throat> Looks like someone was called for holding. Yeah. You've probably heard it said that there's holding on every play. It's just not called. I don't think it's really that prevalent. But you can get away with it sometimes. I don't, I don't even know. times you can't. Now it's second and long after the penalty. Pickens, back to pass. And he's taken down at the 35. Yeah, I know. Hand off inside. Nice run there. Jones gets seven yards on the play. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He's at the 20. 
gains his way yep. to the 10-yard line. Some surprisingly good ball-carrying skills by the big fullback. If he can do more of that, this offense will become even more potent. Inside run, and he's hit hard. And he manages to get back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Second down. Defense gets set to defend the short field. Finds his receiver. Touchdown. And did that play ever oh, come nicely? This is a game here. All about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. I just tied it up, but here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A six-play, 71-yard drive, and a touchdown to result. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. Smith looks ready to kick this one off. He got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchdown. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. <clears throat> Hart comes away with five yards on the carry. <clears throat> what? We've got a second and five. Yeah, it's, it's nice out five. here, too. Side stop quickly. Hart gains about two yards on the run. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Fellas, the crowd is just going ballistic in support of their defense right here. I know. Yes, I just recovered a fumble. What do you think about that last turn? Way to be heads up out there. That corner just made one heck of a play recovering that fumble. drive will start at the 30-yard line. First and 10. Oh, my God. Gets the ball here and brought down in the backfield. Well, I think it's safe to say the defense had his number on that one. It can be very frustrating for a running back when he stopped before he even gets going. run up the middle. Jones picks up about seven yards on the halfback draw. From the 24-yard line, third down. Up the middle of the fullback. Gains his way to the 13-yard line. The play was very well conceived as they were able to get a decent gain in a first down. The party? First down, about 12 yards out. I mean, I don't really need to send my head to... Jones, again, runs outside for a nice game. The tailback picks up a solid seven yards on the counter play. Second down, six yards stand between them and six points. And that's the end of the third quarter. And we'll head into the final quarter of play with a score all knotted up. Yeah. I told him that his place is at the end of the day. I don't know if he realized that. Yeah, it took me a while, but his... 
I don't know if his is or not. I don't really know what this one's for. Let's find out. Way too much jersey there. Pretty easy call for the officials. It's second and 13. Ball on the 16. He'll get it again. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Jones comes away with five yards on the carry. And once again, they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. She's strong. <laughs> oh, big hit. He's going to lose yards. Three-yard loss there. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. Fourth down, they'll line up the field goal unit. This one's from 31 yards out. And the field goal is good. And with that, all the pressure now shifts know. back to the other side. That's what a good kicker can do. Texas A&M to kick this one off. This is crazy stuff. it out to about the 24-yard line. Well, I'm sure the return <clears throat> man would have loved to go for six that time. They have time on the clock, so I wouldn't rush things here. The important thing is to move the ball down the field and put points on the board. On the ground with the tailback. Hart picks up five with the carry. That brings up second and five. From their own 29-yard line. It's second down. Campbell, options out to the left. And there's a penalty on the play. Let's see who it's on. A good tackling safety <clears throat> is key for any defense. And if they can diagnose a play like this guy can, he can be a real menace. It's third and seven. Ball on their own 27. Hmm. Catches it and hit for no gain. I'd say that went about as well as a defense hope. Hope that would. Fourth down. Here comes the punter hmm. looking to boot this one away. Burke is back to receive. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. When he made the decision to return the ball, I'm sure he thought there was going to be some room to run. But boy, did it vanish in a hurry. Still, he got something out of it. Oh, yeah. I'll blame you. You better believe they're going to be working that clock on this drive. It does. Because once you get through there, everything, you don't got nothing to do. He'll give it off here. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. <clears throat> and the delayed handoff works for a big game. Got to be happy with the effort there by your tailback. <clears throat> First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. It was the umpire that threw the flag, and generally, that's a holding penalty. <laughs> holding penalties can really kill momentum. But sometimes, if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. 
Right. So first down once again, but a long ways to go after that penalty. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Pickens on first down. It's complete. He goes down at the 25-yard line. It's first down and 10 now after picking up some great yardage through the air. Texas a and holds a field goal lead. Runs it left for a decent game. Jones gets six yards on the play. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. They'll run it inside and tackle quickly. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. Nice play here by the senior to make the sure tackle. It's not very often that someone's able to shake this guy. <laughs> I don't know if he can send an invite. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Less than three minutes in the game. Pickens steps back to pass. Throws out to the running back, no good. It's fourth down, and they'll attempt the field goal. This one from about 36 yards out. Kicks up. And they tack on three points. <clears throat> Smith is lined up to kick this one off. Oh, what a hit. I have a feeling we haven't seen the end of the fireworks today. I think it goes without saying that this is a very critical possession. They have to be thinking about getting the ball into the end zone because it's getting too late in the game to be thinking about field goals. That's a great tackle at the 32-yard line. <clears throat> <clears throat> Second down and around one yard to go. Ball on the 32. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Campbell steps back to pass. And it's caught. Tackle made at the 37-yard line. So the pass was complete for a gain of five on the play, and that's good enough for a first down. And that's just great execution on that short pass play. Well, my bowl eligibility, folks, is on the line right here. <laughs> I need this to become bowl eligible, and it's going to come down to this drive here if I could stop them. Yes! Yes! Run! Run! Yeah! Yeah! Great job here by the defender breaking on the ball and taking it to the house. That's what I'm talking about! really hurt an offense and have a lasting impact. Right there might have just won this ball game. And they're looking to get two points here. Just under two minutes in the game. Me, yeah. yeah. And the defense holds. They go with a pass, but they come away with nothing. It's tough to decide what to call on these two pointers. Maybe next time they'll just try to hand it off. Smith yep. ready to kick. Snyder from the one. Legs are down, and this one might be on the offense. First 
<clears throat> They'll start this drive at the 10. First down, 10 yards to go. Oh, I thought I was going to pick that off, too. Guys, when we were at practice this week, you kind of got the feeling that they might run a little no huddle. In fact, here it comes. What? Campbell drops to throw. They got to the quarterback a little late there. The officials are keeping a closer eye on hits to the quarterback. So you've got to be careful that it's timed right and that it's clean. And if you really hit him hard, you can easily draw the personal foul. Just under two to go in the game. Sebring is next week, so I can't wait. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. And they get five yards from that completion. Not a bad play. They gain five yards out of it, and they keep moving the defense back. He's to the 40, and he tackles him hard at the 43-yard line. That last catch gives him 100 yards receiving. If you can get open and hold on to the passes, chances are you're going to have a good game, and that's exactly what this guy's been able to do today. Campbell drops to throw. Oh, my God. It's complete. And he's brought down at the 9-yard line. Jesus. Oh, my God. Okay, come on. A little over a minute in the game. Throws this one away. Offside. Home defense. <sighs> First down. First and goal, and they need a touchdown here to get back in this game. Yeah, sounds good. And for Campbell, that's his third touchdown pass of the game. What I'm noticing more and more about this guy see you later, is he's then. very patient with the ball, and it's resulting in some nice scores, just like we've seen today. What's more amazing than anything else is that these guys are still losing. Can he get in? <coughs> he splits the uprights with the extra point. So that's a five-play, 89-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I love these kind of drives. They're old school, grind it out and earn the yards and just rip the heart right out of that defense. They'll bring him down to 39-yard line. Give all the credit <clears throat> in the world to the return unit for coming up with that onside kick. Now all the pressure goes to the defense to make a stand. Texas A&M comes out looking to put this game away. <clears throat> Takes the handoff inside and stopped immediately. Jones gains around three yards on that draw play. Under a minute left. He's at the 30. Gains his way to the 26-yard line. A monster run there by the fullback. You got to wrap the big guy up. You can't allow the fullback to run wild like that on your defense. Under a minute left in the game. Takes the handoff, and the defense stops him short. The way the safety was playing up toward the line of scrimmage shows you what they think of the offense's passing game. Not a lot of respect <clears throat> for it. <clears throat> and they got to him before he could get back to the line. From a defensive coordinator standpoint, it can really help out your scheme when you get excellent run support by the corner.
<clears throat> Takes a knee. We are going to a bowl game, I believe. We should be. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game, Texas A&M 29, Texas 24. What a game that turned out to be. This right here was the play of the game that clinched the victory. Students will enjoy it just as much as the players. They were the better team today and added another great chapter to this rivalry. And for Burke, his play here today has gotten him recognized as our player of the game. For Texas, today's loss doesn't eliminate them from bowl invitation, but rest assured they didn't help their chances. And for Texas A&M, they break even late in what has been an average year. So that wraps things up in another game of NCAA Football 12. For EA Sports, Aaron Andrews and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time. I believe, like I said, that should put us in a bowl game, but I'm not positive. It's, it's really bowl eligible. I don't know if that would mean we're in a bowl game. I mean, we had a tough schedule, so we should be ahead of everybody else that has, you know, six wins. Because we had a, our losses were, you know, a lot of ranked teams, number one and all that stuff. However, I did lose to a really bad Missouri record, but... I made it up by make, beating two ranked teams after that, I think. So, it's been an up and down season. I feel confident about next season, though. So, I, I really do. I feel like I can have a lot better season next year. Um, I've been playing a lot better. I didn't get really blown out in the second half of the season. Like I did, I got blown out two different two games in the first half. But, uh, and I just almost beat... Really, in my mind, I was expecting a loss at Alabama, but but then you know the fact that I fell just that short made it hurt because I had it, I had them, I had them, really, I really had them, and I blew it. Um, but that's a lot of scoring in this game, especially in the second and fourth quarters. After a 0-0 first quarter, a 24 or 29-24 finish. So that's been uh, it was a really good back and forth game here. As I had a lot of first downs. Total offense by five yards, I had them. Uh, 26 rushes for 92 yards. They had a better average rushing. Uh, 12 for 24. They were 15 for 21. They had better passing as well. Hmm. 
But turnovers. I only threw two picks. They threw one pick and then lost a fumble. Uh, total yards, 448 to 442. Very tight in the total yardage for passing, offense, and total yards all within six yards of each. Or within six yards of each other. Look at the pen. This is what I'm talking about. All season... That's all it's been is penalties, penalties, penalties for me. 134 yards of penalties, man. I had four, like three or four holding calls on one drive. That's ridiculous. That's what pretty much lost me a couple games this season was that. And most of them being on kickoffs. You know how many kickoff returns I got called back on me? That I scored a touchdown on at least probably two or three touchdowns. I got called back because of holding. And that's just a kickoffs. I've had a couple touchdown runs as well get called back from holding. That's basically how this season has been going. It's just, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what more to do. I can't. I don't know, man. Well, I got bowling soon, so I'll be leaving in about 20 minutes to go bowling. As we finish six and six, I will take it after being three and five at one point. So I went three and one in the final four games, which was huge. Um, I don't know. Let's advance week to see if we made a bowl game. I don't know. <sighs> If we did make a bowl game, actually, regardless, I might still play a game later on, whether it's the bowl game or start in the next season. I'll figure it out when the time comes. Hmm. Holy shit, it's 70 degrees outside? Awesome.
I just want to see if I make a bowl game, man. <clears throat> Jesus, it, that's the only thing with these college games. There's so much to do that it takes forever to sit, to move from week to week. You get all the recruiting and all that to do. No time left this week. Well, um, I still don't know if I made a bowl game yet, I don't think. season. Let's see if we made a bowl. Iowa, Michigan State on. Iowa is dominating so far this game. They look really good. And they're 0-2. <laughs> they don't look like an 0-2 team playing today. That's for sure. Chris Williams from Florida State wins the Heisman Trophy. And there it is. We have made a bowl game. The Music City Bowl facing Pitt, who was 8-4. Your team received a bid to play in the Music City Bowl in Nashville, Tennessee. All right. Sweet. We are playing a bowl game, guys. Lombardi Award. 
We also run a Returner of the Year award on our team. So we won a couple awards. We are going to a bowl game, which I will try to play later on tonight. Um, definitely want to play the bowl game, and then we can start the new season either tomorrow or next week or whatever. But it'll, uh, there it is. Music City Bowl Bound. So, now that we figured that out, thanks for watching. We'll see you hopefully later on tonight for the Music City Bowl against Pitt. Oh, God. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later on. Enjoy the rest of your day. Enjoy college football Saturday. And we'll try to bring you another college football game later on.